Long ago, there was a sage who spared no effort to teach his people good habits. He often did things that seemed strange and useless, but all he did was to teach the people to be hardworking and cautious. And the sage said, Nothing good can come to a nation whose people complain and expect others to solve their problems. God gives the good things in life to those who deal with problems on their own. One night, while everyone was sleeping, the sage placed a huge stone in the road that passed by the palace. Then he went to hide behind a fence and waited to see what happened. After some time, first came a farmer with a cart loaded with seeds that he took to the mill at the plant. So when he saw the stone on the way he said, Who has seen such carelessness? Why don't these sluggards have this stone removed from the road? And the farmer continued to complain about the uselessness of others, but without even touching himself. In stone. Soon after, a young soldier came singing along the road. He was thinking of the wonderful courage he would show in the war, and he didn't see the stone, but he stumbled on it and sprawled on the dusty ground. He got up, shook the dust off his clothes, took up his sword and raged at the sluggards, who foolishly had left that huge boulder on the road. So he also walked away without thinking a single time that he himself could withdraw the rock. And so the day went. Everyone who passed by complained and grumbled about the stone in the middle of the road, but nobody touched her. Finally, at nightfall, the miller's daughter passed by. She was very hard-working and tired as she had been busy at the mill from an early age, but she said herself, It's already getting dark, someone could trip over this rock and get seriously injured. I'll get her out of the way. And she tried to drag the stone away. It was very heavy, but the girl pushed and pushed and pulled and bent until she could remove it from its place. To her surprise, the young woman found a box under the stone. Then she lifted the box. It was heavy because it was full of something. On the lid was the following words. This box belongs to whoever removes the stone. The young woman opened it and found it filled with gold. The miller's daughter went home with a happy heart. When the farmer and the soldier and all those who passed by the road heard what was, what happened gathered around the place where the stone was, wrapped the dust of the road, with my feet in the hope of finding a piece of gold at all. The sage then appeared and said, My friends, we often encounter obstacles and burdens on our way. We can complain loud and clear as we dodge them if we so choose. Or we can pick them up and find out what they mean. Disappointment is usually the price of laziness. So the sage mounted his horse and, with a polite good night, withdrew. There is no pain without a cause or tears without a just source. Our obstacles now were woven by ourselves. Therefore, let us have the courage to eliminate them with self-effort blows based on charity, which is a light on our roadmap of ascension to God.